Good morning, today is Thursday, October 3rd, 2013, and today's topic is going to be about 4 pi rotations. You know, in simplified math, we often learn that a rotation of 360 degrees takes you right back to zero. But that's not always the case in nature, where there are sometimes strings attached, and sometimes it takes 720 degrees, or a 4 pi rotation, in order to complete the, the loops that occur. Um, in science, they don't usually measure it as 720 degrees, they call it 4 pi in radians. And if Professor Leonard Susskind can demonstrate this in his 70s uh, at a Princeton University lecture on supersymmetry, then I figure most any able-bodied YouTuber should be able to do this as well. Okay, palm up, fingers back, I'm at zero degrees. I rotate 90, 180, 270, and as I'm getting to 360, clearly this doesn't feel like I'm back at zero. But palm is still up, fingers still back. I continue counterclockwise to 540 and 720, and now I'm back to zero. Let's add a prop to demonstrate this is palm up. We go 1 pi, 2 pi, 3 pi, and back, 4 pi. Sometimes nature still has strings attached. If I go 1 pi, 2 pi, then I can keep this oriented the same direction, but I cannot untangle what I've started without continuing to stay in the same tangle. Let's go back to our origin. And I go 1 pi, 2 pi, 3 pi, 4 pi. And now I can go back keeping the orientation and untangle. Here we have a rigid cylinder anchored to the walls of a box. Let's try this. We go rolling 1, 2 pi, and again 4 pi. We grab it around the front and turn it around the back. Likewise, over the front and around the back. And we've restored it without changing the orientation of the cylinder. That's a branch of mathematics known as twistors, and it seems to describe not only the half spins of electrons, but even the double spin field of the gra gravitational field. So, meanwhile, uh, it's something to chew on. Uh, hopefully, next week I'll come up with the twins paradox and the, uh, the ladder and the barn paradox. But in the meantime, this is Joel Twisty Nye wishing you happy trails. I will see you next week.